Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Janine and if you guys are new then I hope you guys consider subscribing and if you guys are not new then of course welcome back as always. <music> Today I think I have a pretty solid plan for the day um, in terms of like what I want to do in the kitchen but for the most part that's pretty much it like I think I want to make a banana bread because I have some bananas on the table that are going bad so I want to use those up before they do go bad and I also want to make some curry chicken um, but before I do any of that there are dishes in the sink as high as a mountain so I have to tackle those I just went through and like cleaned up the second bedroom because that has honestly been like my hub I've just been laying in there watching TV all hours of the night I just woke up at like 10 o'clock it's 11 28 right now I woke up at 10 o'clock and I felt like I was hit by a bus because I was up until like I think one o'clock watching something on Netflix that I didn't even bother with after a while because I'm just like okay so I just realized that I don't even really like this like that. So that was annoying. As I'm here talking, let me check on something real quick because I feel like I'm at this point in existence. I'm really so darn annoyed. But what are we going to do? Anyways, I have a window in which like if I don't get it by like a, that time, then obviously I can um, report it and say I didn't get it. But yesterday I really had to call USPS and be like, yo, what's up? Because... I haven't received my package and it's been a hot ass minute and so I spoke to someone who said they're going to talk to someone who said they're going to talk to someone and then some guy called me back afterwards and you know he was saying he's going to check to see what's up but for the most part he's going to have to um somebody else is going to call me back and I'm just like I mean okay I guess it's good that I'm getting answers but I feel like that's so much of like a run around too so it's just annoying oh so annoying so um yeah I think I'm also gonna wipe the floors today so um I want to do that after I've like messed up the whole kitchen with the banana bread the banana bread mixture and whatever so that's what I want to do first the banana bread so I'm gonna pop in there and do that the last time that I made the banana bread that was hitting okay that was one of my best banana breads to this date loved that and I made sure that I wrote the recipe out in my notes so when I'm ready I can go back and like look at it to see the exact mixtures and stuff that I used yes sir now, see I've been making banana breads for a hot ass minute because I really really like them but I found that before I wanted it to be a little bit more moist so I ended up adding more bananas and whatever but I'm really, really excited about this. I have some milk inside of the inside of the fridge, but I turned up the the whatever in the bottom half of the fridge. So right now I'm gonna have to take the milk out because everything on the top shelf in the bottom half of the fridge is frozen because I turned the thing up to the coldest setting. So that's annoying. So I'm gonna have to take the milk out so it could like start defrosting or whatever before I can even attempt to make this banana bread but I think in the meantime I might just make I've had this smoothie mix inside of the fridge for a hot ass minute that I said I'm gonna try making and I just have not been feeling for it every morning when I wake up I have not been feeling for it so I still haven't even attempted to make it yet it's just there and I just feel like I, it's about time I did something about it you know because if I oh so my hub don't look too good so these are the bananas that I'm going to use. Normally, I like when they're more um, ripe than this. So like they're like more speckled. But I also have some in the fridge. Because normally when I have the banana and... Are we good, sis? Normally when I have the banana and they go... They're getting old. I like peel them and put them in Ziploc bags. And put them in the freezer so this right here is a few oh these ones look so much better i don't think this is enough though i don't even need three so i think i'll use these two because these look good those look nice and old so i'll use those 
and one of the ones on the table and I'll leave the other two to get a little bit older and then I'll add them to this bag. I'm going to make some curry chicken. The chicken is already seasoned up and everything and in the fridge. So I'm not going to take it out yet because right now it's 11.30 and I'm not even nearly ready to start cooking it. What I'm going to do right now, however, is clean up this kitchen because this dish is in the sink. And I'm very annoyed, but they got to go. So gonna do that while I watch a couple of YouTube videos and then um, I'll come back a little bit later so we'll see what I end up doing but whatever I do I'm gonna come back so you guys can see because obviously we don't have anything else to do around here Hey guys, so as y'all saw, I did the dishes, cleaned up the kitchen, and <laughs> lit my candle. So right now inside here smells really, really good, which love that for me. So what I'm going to move on to doing right now is preparing the things that I need to make the banana bread and actually start getting that together. But before I do all that, I'm going to try preheating the oven because sometimes it, because it does take a while. So by the time I'm done with the mixture and everything, then it would be done preheating. I'm going to put it at, I think I should put it at 450. Four fifty. It says to bake it at 350, but I really never bake it at 350. So um, I'm going to now get the things together and all that. So I just put the banana bread inside of the oven. The camera died earlier when I was about to like whip it up and everything. So that's why you guys didn't see that. But I just put it in the oven and I have it at 400 degrees for 50 minutes. Now, when I was done and I like poured it into the pan and everything, it felt a little bit thick. Like the mixture felt a little bit thicker. That could very well mean that it needs a little bit more water or, well, not necessarily water but it needs a little bit more liquid. So maybe more milk or like more oil or butter. I don't know, but I put it in there anyways. <laughs> now I set a reminder for like 45 minutes before it's done. So like five minutes before it's done so I can check on it to see like what the status is of it and everything. And just to make sure that it's fine. But I'm gonna be really bummed out if that thing comes out of the oven dry. I didn't use three eggs this time because what I noticed the last time was that um, it couldn't stay for as long anymore when I used the three eggs. Like it spoiled quicker because of the three eggs. Normally I'd use two. So I just used two this time and everything else that I'd normally use. But I don't know why it was a little bit thicker. And the milk was good because I tasted the milk before and everything. But I don't know. Okay, I don't know. Right now it is 12.27 and I'm going to take the chicken out that I'm going to cook today and just leave it on the counter here. So it could start like defrosting on its own and later on I'll cook it. I'm going to make curry chicken, but that's really quick. So I don't need to prepare way ahead of time. What I could do is put the rice on in the rice cooker right now, but that too is 
going to be done in like, what, 15, 20 minutes? And I'm not ready to do that yet. So when I come back in here and I'm going to start cooking the chicken, then I'll put the rice on at the same time. But for right now, this is the moment where I'm going to chill and like watch some TV or watch some videos or whatever. Just do me, really. So yeah. guys so this is where i've decided to wrap up today's video thank you guys for hanging out with me in the kitchen today while i made my banana bread and pretty much just clean up around the apartment i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in the very next one Should be closer to friends. I